Hello my brothers and sisters, and welcome back to another Rapture packed episode of Chris the Butcher. I'm French. And tonight I'm doing something very butchering. No, I'm not doing butchering at all, I've got room in my kitchen. But by the thumbnail and the title you will know, I have a massive amount of pig skin. But I took that skin off myself and I left a good amount of fat on it as well. So I'm going to be doing... Oh! Sounds, sounds right, that does it? Sounds a bit wrong. Stop it, Lou. Lou, behave yourself. I'm going to be doing my very own pork scratchings. on with this recipe I'm going to carry on with uh, doing the little shout outs so today's shout out belongs to Ben Bucks he wants 3,000 subscribers I think by the 4th of May or something I think it's his birthday so yes Ben Bucks subscribe uh, the link to his channel will be in the description right let's get down here and do this crackling Crackling, crackling. No, I'm not going to be doing the crackling down here. Obviously, the crackling is going to be done in the magic box called the oven, the oven, the oven, the foven. Ah, oh, fuck me. You know what I mean, don't you? This should be simple, right? I've got my oven preheated to 200 degrees. There's my, there's my pigskin. The pork rind, really, the technical word for it is, and. It's quite big, this. You've got to wait for this fucking thing there, right? I'm not doing things by half here. Look at that lovely fat. Look at this. Fuck me, it's huge. I didn't think it was that big, to be honest. Uh, fuck. <laughs> uh, a bit too much here for fucking... I think I'll do two lots, actually. Right. Put that to one side. I'm going to score the fat as well. Just to help the uh, the salt, because I'm going to salt both sides. You know what I mean? We're not, we're not, we're not playing games. And uh, I think I might go for like a kind of a, you know, the squares. I'm hoping. That'll do. I'm hoping it'll uh, it'll be right. Or in all as this eh, it'll be right. And uh, I'm going to hit it with some uh, garlic fry light. I'm going to use that as the oil. Get that rubbed in because you know what we fucking love garlic in this house. Do I do it on the other side as well? Uh, yeah, in a minute. First things first, I'm going to get some salt. I got some coarse sea salt and I ground and I uh, bashed the fuck out of it in the Adam and Garrett. And then we're going to really, really liberally coat the skin in the salt. We want salt everywhere. This has to be salty. Otherwise, it's not going to work, is it? There we go. More salt. Push it in. Bang it in. Bang it in that skin. Uh, I've decided I'm not going to do the fat. The fat's just going to render down a little bit in the oven anyway. And it'll probably cook in that. In its own. It'll cook its own fat. Now, I've seen people do it with uh, um, racks. But I'm not that babyish. I'm not bothering doing that. So. Hang on. i better get off here in a minute. There's my skin in the roasting tin and it's going to go in there on 200 degrees for about an hour I will be checking it uh, on its way because I don't want to completely fuck it do I? right one hour 
Right, it's been half an hour. As you can see, oh, door went loose. Oh, God. Reflection there, shitty background. It's been half an hour. Let's have a look. I have got two on the go because I couldn't fit them all in one. You can't really see it, but they're looking good. I've got one on the bottom as well. Mmm. Fucking roast. Can you hear that? Yes and ah. Yeah. Definitely at least another half hour. Right, my brothers and sisters, it's been a lot longer than I anticipated. It's been more than an hour and a half. I had it on 200 degrees for the last 15 minutes, I had on 250. But here it is. Here's one of them anyway. Look at that. I've got to cut it yet. But what I want to do is I want to get it out of the... Uh, out of the roasting tin using the uh, using the Dave. Like losing my skin on my fingers. There we go. Now, I did cook uh, both halves of that. I've got the other one in the oven. It's not quite ready yet because I had to uh, keep rotating it on the uh, in the oven. But look at the fucking shit that's come out of that. When I say shit, that is pork fat. Now, I'm going to strain that at some point, And I'm going to do a pork fat roast potato video. Because I'm not you, I'm not losing that fucking ball of fucking goodness. No chance. I said, took it into Lou. I said, look how much fat I've rendered out with that. I just went, oh God, that smells good. It's hard to heart attack in a ball. So yes, I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna like settle. I'm gonna we just like Keelan coming out to eject him. Like Night Rider in the ejector seat. <laughs> uh, who remembers Night Rider? I used to love Night Rider. Michael Knight and Kit, stuff like that. And I watched it recently and thought, what a fucking pile of shit. I used to love it as a kid. Anyway. We're going to let that rest for five minutes. Then I'm going to get my knife. I'm going to cut it into nice little chunks. So we've got our pork scratchings. And it's rested. Listen. Listen. ASMR. Oh, yes. Now, I'm going to try and attempt to cut this. Oh, 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 oh. It's breaking up, can you see? This is going to be... Oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. I know my arms it way. It's breaking off, look. I left fat on it so it get... Hopefully it'll be a bit moist as well. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ. That... Oh, did you see fat come out of that then? Shit! Still quite hot actually. Oh! 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 You better ring the paramedics right now because I'm gonna go into a fat seizure. There are my. Hello. Shoot me through a ball. Port scratchings. Let's see, what, yeah, let's see if I can see your proper close up. Look at that. Oh, I've got to slide one of these down my gizzard. Look at look at them. Oh. Damn. Ah. Uh, salty. Porky. Out this wall. Oh. You know what? Port skin, if you can get it. Go to your butchers. If you live near me and you know where I work and you come in the shop, I will sell you that fucking cheapest shit. You could do that as well. Only a bit of oil. 
I love them. A good amount of salt and some fucking patience. Oh god, look at that one. Ah, oh. mmm, mmm. Fuck her now. I better get Luke at the defibrillator out of the fucking cupboard. I'm gonna fucking need it. Do you know what, brothers and sisters? They are the best thing I have had or produced in this kitchen or on this channel in a fucking eon. You gotta try it. Pig, uh, pig rind, pork rind, whatever you wanna call it, is absolutely cheap as shit. And, you know what I mean? You can't eat it every day, do we? You can't eat it, you have to eat it once a year because it's absolutely fucking orgasmic. Oh, orgasmic! Oh, I loved it. If you like this, press like, comment, share it on your social media, and subscribe. And become a family member of hashtag TeamCTB. Where I fucking love you.